name of Jesus Christ. Today's thought also from Isaiah chapter 54. Isaiah 54 verse 17. Isaiah 54 verse 17. I will read the verse for you. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. And every tongue which rises against you in judgment you shall condemn. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord. And the righteousness is from me, says the Lord. For the past few days, we are meditating from this chapter, Isaiah 54. The verse 17, the first part of this verse says, No weapon formed against you shall prosper. Many times, many types of weapons formed against the children of God. Many times, the children of God goes through different battle or different struggles. The enemy is throwing different weapons to hurt them, to kill them, to destroy them. But the promise of God says, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. The Lord is able to protect you from all the weapons of the enemy. Bible talks about many servants of God, how God protect the protected them especially if you see the life of David how God protected him David was a blessing to King Saul whenever David plays the harp the evil spirit will depart from King Saul but the same King Saul tried to kill David many times by throwing the spears sometimes cunningly King Saul will send David to the battlefield Whenever he sends him, he used to say like this, you are the one doing God's battle, so go and do the battle. But the real heart of King Saul is to kill him in the battlefield through the Philistines. King Saul thought, let him die through these Philistines in this battlefield. So his heart was not right. Very cunningly, he threw the weapons against David. But Bible says, the Lord protected David from all the evil plans of King Saul. Maybe you are also going through different battles by throwing the darts of the enemy. The enemy is throwing different weapons against you, but the Lord wants to encourage you today. Nothing will hurt you. He will protect you. God is able to protect you safely. So never give up. Don't be discouraged. The Lord is your shield. He is doing your battle. Shall we do a word of prayer? Let's pray. Dear Lord Jesus, I bring each and, each and every one under your mighty hand, O God. You know your people are going through different kinds of battle. The enemies keep on throwing his weapons against your children. Lord, thank you for protecting them so far. Continuously keep them safe. Continuously protect them, Lord. Let your mighty hand help them. Lord, you are the shield for them. Lord, I cancel and rebuke all the plans of the enemy in Jesus' name. Whoever touches you, they are touching the apple of his eye. No one can stand against God. No one can stand against you. Lord, thank you for giving this assurance to your children, O oh God. Lord, encourage them, bless them, protect them, Lord. Who is going through challenges in their workplace? Lord, you keep them safe, Lord. Every cunning plans of the enemy be removed from that place in Jesus' name. Lord, who is going through time of fear, set them free. Lord Jesus, let your protection be upon your children and their family, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I pray for divine protection, O oh God. Thank you for standing as a shield for your children, O oh God continuously encourage them encourage them thank you for this promise isaiah 54 17 we claim it we inherit it lord thank you lord i pray for the people those are doing ministry lord encourage them protect them from every evil attack oh god i pray for servants of god keep them under your mighty wings oh god thank you lord thank you lord in jesus name we pray amen the lord is able to protect you amen